Hello, I'm looking for Mr. Herpy. Berthold? Bertie. Hello? Berthold. Who is it? How you doing, you old gay bastard? Who? Oh, oh, my God, how many years has it been? You know, who, who, are you speak, who are you speaking? This is Edgar Rosenthal. Who? <coughs> Edgar? Andy? Yes, exactly. How have you been, man, after all these years? I know who, 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 Excuse me? Yeah, but with whom I'm talking? This is, um, I just told you, Ernie Rosenthal. Ernie Rosenthal? Exactly. No. Man, I remember you like it was yesterday, back in the old country. You and me. Yeah, Ernie. In the shower room after gym. Oh, I don't... Swapping I... each other up the bum. Who? You remember. Who? Um, Ernie. A bit early. Are you having the senility or something? Uh, Is everything all right? Yeah, but which Ernie? I have other friend here, Ernie Rosenthal. You have, you know, too, Ernie Rosenthal? Yeah. I'm the short, fat one. No. From that do we... You remember me? I, I wouldn't know that accent anywhere. Berthold, you remember when we used to go drinking out on the town? Yeah, well... <laughs> passing out in the gutter and having sex with $2 whores? Those, that, those were the good old days. Yeah. I long for those days. They were where did we drink together? Excuse me? Which place? When did we when did we meet? When did we meet? We met back in the old country. And yeah, I, I met you over here when I was in New York. Maybe you were here for the expo or something. And I saw you again and we went out for drinks and we got so drunk that we ended up beating up a hooker and passing out in the gutter. Oh, I don't Just like an old Hemingway novel or something. It was. I cannot. I cannot remember. <laughs> well, I'm not surprised. I can hardly remember that night either. You remember we actually went into that that gay bar and all the leather guys were dancing around and they wanted to put you in a ball gag. No. You wanted to do it too, but I stopped you because I knew you were too drunk and you'd regret it the next day. Oh no, I was not too drunk. But you didn't stop me from getting that tattoo on my ass. No, I. I you remember that? No, I I, I... I was so drunk. I was so piss-ass drunk, I got a butterfly tattoo on my ass, and you didn't stop me. I wake I, up, and my ass is all sore the next day when we woke up in the gutter, and I'm like, what the hell? And you told me what happened, and I was like, dude, why didn't you stop me? I can no remember. I'm not surprised. I can hardly remember those days, because um, we were doing a lot of stuff that night. Yeah, well... We, we were smoking... In which city? This was New York. You remember? Oh... You were, it was probably, what is it, what is it, 20, 25 years ago in New York I City? I was one time in New York. When it's a long time ago, and my memory is failing as well because of all the drugs and booze I did in the old days. The message from my son. Oh, yeah, you were in town because your son was getting married. Yeah. That's right. I remember now, I met you at the reception. I, I was a friend on the bride's side, and I was there with my wife. And my wife, my wife took the car out so that we could go out drinking on the town. And you were driving, but um, I, I you're a pretty good driver when you drove. I didn't drive in New York. You didn't drive? No. Oh, that's right. We had a taxi. And maybe my my other zone. I remember you I, vomited in the taxi. You remember that? Uh, the taxi wanted an extra five dollar tip because he was going to have to clean up the vomit. No. I, oh, those were the good old days. I have pictures too. Yeah. I have. I have. Where yeah, are you? I'm living in Connecticut now. Huh? How how has his wife been treating you? How's how's the old lady? Well, my lady. How yeah? How is she? I don't have my my wife died. Oh, I'm sorry. Two wives died. Both of them. No, well, sir. Maybe it's my your third cooking. Wife, my first wife died, and then I married again. Uh huh. And she died too. Oh wow! I, I'm still with uh, Jill. You remember my wife, Jill? No. I'm still with her. She's driving me crazy, and uh, I'm thinking about poisoning her. No, She's a crazy I, bitch. I cannot, I cannot remember. The house is constantly filled with smoke, and there's always cats meowing everywhere, and the cats cough. The cats cough from all the smoke. I, I have no, I, uh, really, I cannot, uh, I can, something I can still remember. Well, when I looked up your phone number, I also got your address, Berthold. So I'm going to send you these pictures I have. They're, they're pictures yeah. of you and me when we went out on the, on the town. And okay. some, of, some of it was taken at the reception. And there are some later on at the titty bar. And we got a couple at the gay bar with the gay guys posing and everything. Oh, pretending like he's whipping if you with you a cat of nine tails. If you want to do write me a little bit, then maybe I can remember. Okay. 
Yeah. Sounds good. My, yeah. my, my address is... Uh... No, 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 no. I have your address already. Yeah. I, my, I got your address when I looked up your phone number. I used the computer. Do you have a computer? Not me, but my son has a computer. I know the computers are very intimidating, and sometimes I'm afraid it's going to steal my pills, but I use yeah. the computer, and uh, I'm actually running a website. No, oh, I, I don't know nothing about a computer. Yeah, I know. I, 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 you know, to me, an abacus is a computer. Yeah, I know, yeah. Yeah. You are, you, maybe you are a few years younger than I. I'm, I'm, I know I don't sound like it, but I'm 48. 40. I know, you must be in your, your late 60s or early oh, 70s. Oh, yeah, 60 for, for 30 years. <laughs> I'm 93. You're 93? Uh, oh, my God. Now I'm all the more impressed at the way you can drink. Uh, you could... Oh, so I drink a uh, You a could... Bit. I never drink too much. No, that night you drank like a sailor out on a 48-hour pass. One the glass beer when I go to my club, I have a beer. Exactly. Uh, so I'm still... I'm still... I'm... I'm not, I'm all, all than age of a, but not on my tune. I'm still, oh, I, I had an accident, so now in the moment, I go on a, on a... You had an accident? Yeah. Well, you, you can go to the bathroom, wipe your ass, and come back. I'll wait. You had an accident? Yeah. What kind of an accident? Oh, I fell down in Reno. I went to a, to a wedding... And I didn't watch the step, and I fell down. Oh my God! No, I go on the. I have to go on the walker. On the walker? Yeah. Oh. Whatever, I'm okay. Well, well, if it makes you feel any better, Joe is on a respirator. Who? If it makes if it makes you feel any better, Joe is on a respirator. No, no. I don't don't have to go on the again. No. I'm, I'm so far. I'm 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 healthy. I don't have any. I'm not sick, and I don't have. Any. Any complaint? No. Well, God bless you, Bertold. Yeah. I recently made a, a ton of money on the internet in, yeah. in stocks and bonds and everything. Y your name is Ernie Rodenthal? Exactly. Yeah, I have a friend, Ernie Rodenthal. His wife died. We, we was the funeral yesterday, so that's why I, I thought that the... No, you're thinking of the wrong Ernie. Ernie? Yeah, I think you're thinking of the wrong Ernie. Yeah. Because I, my wife is fine. She's on a respirator, and she has the iron lung and everything, and, and the prosthetic leg oh. from the uh, the diabetes, but uh, uh, she's so still there. And uh, it's always, you have always trouble, and when somebody gets sick, I had to, my first wife, she died with 53, and oh. uh, she had a, uh, and she had the age? Had, she had a brain tumor. Oh, my God. My second wife, and she was 53 years old when I had a three kid. So then my second wife, she, she, and she was 84. She had a, this, uh, how call it? This, 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 uh, with, uh, with pay, this, see them. You, you speak German too? You come from Germany? Oh, I, by the time I left Germany, I was so young, I can't remember any of it anymore. And from which city you come? My, my, well, I, I didn't live there very long because my parents came over here, but we were born in Krakow. Or I was oh. born in Krakow. Oh, yeah. And they brought me over here because, you know, they had to get the hell out of there really quick. Oh, yeah, and I, if you came for as a kid, then you can no more remember. No, I can't remember. Uh, yeah. Now, yeah, what would be nice is uh, if you come to San Francisco... Well that's, well, that's what I'm saying. I made a lot of money on the Internet, and I've, I've been contacting my old friends, and uh, I'm basically, I don't have a, well, I don't have a real job anymore. I just got money in the bank, and I'm just yeah. traveling the world and visiting uh, all my interesting old friends that I haven't seen oh. in years and years. Yeah, that's, that's good. But uh, you know what? I'm going to send you these photos, because you'll see me in the photos, and maybe that'll help you remember who I am. Oh, yeah. And um, and I'll give you a call back. After you get the pictures, I'll give you a call back, and we'll talk again. But not too late. No, it is soon. Okay. It's 9.30. I'm soon already in the bed. Oh, okay. I'm sorry. I woke you up. No, no, yeah. You couldn't, you, you couldn't notice, and then you have other time like here, so this is always. Yeah. Sometimes I say always after 9 o'clock, I don't want any calls except somebody make a mistake. Oh, that is a... a Okay. And, and, and now that somebody needs... Well, 
Berthold, I'll call you in the afternoon. I'll, I'll mail the pictures out tomorrow. It'll take them like uh, a few days to get there. And I'll yeah, give you a call next week, uh, but early in the afternoon. You can call me till 9 o'clock. Okay. I'm home, yeah. Well, you take it easy, and I'll talk to you soon. Yeah. God bless okay. you. Okay, yeah, same. Bye-bye. Thanks for calling. Bye-bye. <laughs>